it's time to check out another new Sleep Token track. Sleep Token have been releasing some really interesting and experimental tracks this year. Some of the best stuff I've ever heard from them, honestly. And each release is new and different and weird in ways that the others haven't been. Um, ever since the summoning, you know, I haven't known what to expect. Well, this track comes with the announcement of their new album, Take Me Back to Eden. I'm sure it's going to be a wild ride. I can't wait to check that album out. And uh, I can't wait to check this song out. I've heard a couple things here and there that the song is pretty heavy. So let's just dive right into it and see what it's all about. Man. instrument that one I don't know what that is but it's nice maybe a dulcimer sitar I don't know dark melodies in the background Oh, something's about to happen. Ooh, okay. What the heck is this video? My stocks are like crying blood, like... What the heck? 
this curse. That was Sleep Token with their new song, Vore. Let's break it down. I mean, this was a weird one. I mean, I don't know. I don't like, I mean, they're all weird. <laughs> but this one was, I feel like, an especially strange pick for a single. It didn't feel particularly hooky or like bombastic or anything like that. Um, it was a really, really interesting track. Definitely extremely heavy. But nothing about it was. Um, I don't know, like incredibly like jarring or um, there wasn't like that one moment, you know, that you're like, oh, wow, that that one, that's that's what everyone's going to remember, react to. Um, it just felt like a really solid song uh, with a lot of depth and nuance, kind of just like an, like an, um, a deep cut off of an album, honestly. But that, that's not to say that I didn't like this. I really did. I, I liked the tones that we were getting here with the guitars, big, big open chords, a lot of just like huge wall of sound guitars, almost bridging on shoegaze at some points. Um, and then of course you got the little passages of like Thal-esque riffs and things like that. And the vocals, man, that never mind the beautiful clean vocals that we always get with Sleep Token, but these were some like black metal, like, goblin screaming in a cave kind of vocals almost reminded me a little bit of like death heaven like this could have been a song we got off of um sun bay there it just like the, something about the way that vocals were mixed like they're really far back in the mix loud loud guitars it's a very black metal thing to do um but the guitars um were more of like the kind of modern metal rather than a black metal guitar with lots of tremolo and lo-fi and whatever um you know, kind of like Deaf Heaven, honestly. Um, at least their older stuff, like Son Sunbay there. But yeah, this was this is a, a wild one. Like, like I said, you never know what to expect with these guys. You know, the last song we got was like a weird, steamy electronic ballad, and now we got this like blackened modern Thal metalcore. Uh, like, what's happening? <laughs> I don't know. I'm here for the ride. This is wild and so much fun to check out with you guys. I've really enjoyed checking out all these tracks. Their album's coming out in May, I believe, so if you want to get that, I'll leave links to pre-order it in the description below, so be sure to grab that if that's something you're interested in. Let me know what you guys thought of this track in the comments down below, and how, let me know where it stacks up for you in terms of the other singles. I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts on that. If you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a like and subscribe. It really, really helps out the channel. That's going to do it for me today, and I'll see you in the next one.